A grand jury has declined to indict rapper Travis Scott and five others in connection with the deadly crowd crush at the 2021 Astroworld Festival in Houston, prosecutors said. Harris County District Attorney Kim Ogg said the grand jury on Thursday returned no bills on all criminal charges related to the deaths of the 10 spectators. The grand jury found that no crime did occur, that no single individual was criminally responsible, Ogg said during a press briefing. Ten people died, including a nine-year-old boy, after the crowd rushed toward the stage during headline and festival founder Travis Scott's set. Thousands were injured, according to attorneys representing people suing Scott, promoter Live Nation, and dozens of other companies. According to Houston police and witness accounts, a wave of tens of thousands of people moved toward the stage when Scott, and later rapper Drake, appeared. Concert attendees said they were pushed into one another from all sides. As the crowd pressed its way forward, some began to fall, pass out, and get trampled by others in the audience. The ten victims died from compression asphyxia and were located in the same general area, police said. One of the key contributing factors to the deaths was the overpopulation and resulting compaction in this quadrant, Houston Detective Michael Barrow told reporters during the press briefing. This was not a crowd stampede. This was not a stage rush. This was not a crowd surge. This was a slow compaction or constriction into this quadrant, resulting in collapses within the crowd. Houston Police Chief Troy Finner said police completed their criminal investigation into the incident last week, calling it a very complex investigation. The investigation will be publicly released, he said. In addition to Scott, the grand jury weighed whether any criminal charges should be filed against festival manager Brent Silberstein, John Junell with Live Nation, Shauna Boardman and Saith Boardman, with Crowd Management Company Contemporary Services Corporation, and Emily Akendon with production company BWG, according to court documents. Alicia Harvey, a prosecutor with the Harris County District Attorney's Office, said possible charges under consideration were limited to crimes that can be committed by omission, such as child endangerment. Charges of manslaughter or criminally negligent homicide would have needed an act of causation to be sustained in front of the grand jury, she said. An attorney for Scott called the 19-month investigation one of the most exhaustive investigations in the history of the Houston Police Department, in remarks to reporters Thursday. As long as there was a pending criminal investigation, it makes it extremely difficult to get insured, Schaffer said. Now he's going to be able to pick back up where he left off. Following the concert, Scott released a statement on Twitter, saying, I'm absolutely devastated by what took place last night. My prayers go out to the families and all those impacted by what happened at Astroworld Festival.